Welcome to DIY Tech. Wi-Fi extender not accepting password. When a Wi-Fi extender is not accepting the password there are several potential issues that could be causing this problem. Here are some steps you can take to troubleshoot and resolve the issue. 1. Verify the password check case sensitivity. Ensure that you are entering the password exactly as it is, including any uppercase and lowercase letters, numbers, and special characters. Double-check the password, make sure you are using the correct Wi-Fi network password. Sometimes, it's easy to mix up passwords for different networks. 2. Check network settings SSID mismatch. Make sure the SSID, network name, you are trying to connect to is correct. Sometimes extenders create a new SSID with a slight variation, e.g., adding underscore EXT or underscore 2GXT at the end. Network type. Ensure that the extender is compatible with your router's network type, e.g., 2.4 GHz versus 5 GHz. 3. Reset the extender factory reset. Perform a factory reset on the Wi-Fi extender. There is usually a reset button that needs to be pressed and held for about 10 to 15 seconds, reconfigure. After resetting, reconfigure the extender by following the setup instructions provided by the manufacturer. For firmware updates check for updates visit the manufacturer's website to check if there is a firmware update for your Wi-Fi extender. Updating the firmware can resolve compatibility issues and bugs. 5. Placement and signal strength location Ensure the extender is within range of your primary router and that it is receiving a strong signal. Interference Avoid placing the extender near devices that may cause interference, e.g., microwaves, cordless phones. 6. Compatibility Router Compatibility Make sure your Wi-Fi extender is compatible with your router. Some extenders may not work well with certain routers, especially if they are from different manufacturers. 7. Manual Configuration Access Extender Settings Connect to the extender using an Ethernet cable or through its default Wi-Fi network. Access the settings via a web browser usually by entering an IP address like 192.168.1.1 or a URL provided in the manual. 8. Check for security protocol security settings ensure the security protocol, WPA, WPA2, etc., of the extender matches the router's settings. Some extenders might not support the latest security protocols. 9. Power cycle restart devices turn off the router, the extender, and any connected devices. Wait for a few minutes, then turn them back on in this order, router, extender, and finally, your devices. Thanks for watching.